The internet is everywhere, and not just PCs and servers, but also smartphones, music devices, appliances, and so on. In fact, analysts predict there will be more than 22 billion internet-attached devices by the end of the decade. The problem is, there simply won't be enough internet addresses to go around. The current IP standard, IPv4, allows for just more than 4 billion IP addresses. A new standard, IPv6, obliterates that limit with roughly 340 undecillion unique addresses. If you have trouble grasping just how many more addresses that represents, try this. Comparing IPv4's address space to IPv6's is like comparing one human tier to 68 times the volume of all the Earth's oceans. So, good news. IPv6 will fix the world's IP address availability problems. But how do we get there? We cannot switch over all at once. There are just too many devices, companies, and people involved for that. No, we live in a world where IPv4 and IPv6 addresses must coexist. And that means service providers must manage this migration for customer devices as well as for back-end core services. F5's local traffic managers, or LTMs, sitting between your customers and your servers, are perfectly positioned to act as an IPv4 to IPv6 gateway. For example, imagine your back-end servers all running IPv4. F5's LTM sits in the middle, load balancing requests to all the servers. To switch a server to IPv6 is simple. First, bring the server offline. F5 simply balances requests to the remaining servers. Switch the server to IPv6 and bring that server back online. F5 includes the server in future load balancing operations, but now uses the new IPv6 address to connect with it. Now let's look at customers with a mix of addresses. All you have to do is create an IPv6 DNS entry for your F5 LTM that complements your IPv4 DNS entry. Now, customers can access your network with either IPv6 or IPv4 and still get to any of your back-end servers. Ultimately, the F5 LTM can enable live sessions between customer devices and back-end core services, even if they are not using the same protocol. For example, a device using IPv4 can establish a live session with a back-end core service that uses IPv6. The switch from IPv4 to IPv6 is a necessary and welcome change. With F5's LTM, it can also be an uneventful change. F5, service delivery networking for your next generation infrastructure.